Once upon a time in a serene village nestled between lush hills, there lived a wise old monk named Kaido. The villagers admired him not only for his profound teachings but also for his unwavering tranquility in the face of life's trials. One day, a young and troubled villager named Hiro approached Kaido with a heavy heart. Master Kaido, Hiro sighed, why do bad things happen to good people? It seems unjust and unfair. Kaido smiled gently and motioned Hiro to sit beside him beneath the shade of a cherry blossom tree. He began, Hiro, imagine the river that flows through our village. It meanders through fields and forests, sometimes rushing with great force and at other times flowing gently. In its journey, the river encounters rocks and obstacles that shape its course. Hiro nodded, intrigued by the analogy. Kaido continued, life, too, is like a river. It moves along its path, encountering moments of turbulence and moments of calm. Just as the river's flow is influenced by the terrain it encounters, our lives are shaped by the circumstances we face. But, Master Kaido, Hiro interrupted, why must good people suffer? Shouldn't their virtue shield them from pain? Kaido nodded thoughtfully. Consider the cherry blossom tree under which we sit, he said. In spring, it graces us with its delicate blossoms, and in autumn, it offers its sweet fruit. Yet, even this tree endures storms and harsh weather. Its resilience and strength are what allow it to bear its gifts. Similarly, good people may face hardships, not as a punishment, but as opportunities for growth and inner strength. Just as the river's challenges mold its course, life's difficulties shape our character and offer us the chance to deepen our wisdom and compassion. Hiro pondered Kaido's words. So, Master Kaido, you're saying that bad things happen to good people not out of cruelty, but as a way for them to become stronger and wiser? Kaido nodded, his eyes reflecting the serenity of a tranquil pond. Precisely, Hiro. Just as a river cannot always be calm, and a cherry blossom tree cannot avoid all storms, life's challenges are an inherent part of our journey. Embrace them with an open heart, for they are the very currents that sculpt us into beings of greater understanding and grace. As the sun began to set, Hiro felt a sense of peace wash over him. He thanked Master Kaido for his wisdom and walked away with a newfound perspective on the mysteries of life. And from that day onward, whenever Hiro faced challenges, he remembered the river's flow and the cherry blossom's resilience, finding solace in the understanding that even amidst adversity, there lay the potential for growth and transformation. The moral of this story is that life's challenges and hardships, even when they seem unjust or unfair, are not necessarily punishments or cruelties. Instead, they serve as opportunities for personal growth, inner strength, and the development of wisdom and compassion. Just as a river's flow is shaped by the obstacles it encounters, and a cherry blossom tree's resilience allows it to bear fruit despite storms, individuals can find strength and transformation through adversity. Embracing challenges with an open heart and understanding that they contribute to one's character can lead to a deeper appreciation of life's journey.